टॉकिंग अबाउट द अपॉर्चुनिटीज ड्यूरिंग दैट टाइम ब्रांड एंडोर्समेंट्स में तो ओनली एक्टर्स दिखते हैं उस वक्त मॉडल्स सब करते थे दिस वाज अ मॉडल्स जॉब देयर आर टू मेनी ब्यूटीफुल गर्ल्स एंड एवरीवन वांट्स टू गेट इनटू मॉडलिंग दे यूज इट एज अ स्टेपिंग स्टोन टू गेट इनटू बॉलीवुड कोई बैड एक्सपीरियंस आपके साथ हुआ है और एनी स्टोरीज दैट यू वांट टू शेयर द फैशन इंडस्ट्री इज अ इज अ रायट वी इवन हियर स्टोरीज ऑफ मॉडल्स यू नो वांटिंग टू पे टू विन अ पैजेंट आप आज पे कर लोगे लेकिन कल जब आप हायर प्लेटफॉर्म पे जाओगे देन व्हाट यू गोना डू आजकल वो सुपर मॉडल का ब्रैकेट है ही नहीं सब मॉडल्स हैं सब सुपर मॉडल्स हैं पैजेंट्स बीइंग प्रीफिक्स्ड आई हैव हर्ड ऑफ पैजेंट्स एंड एंड गर्ल्स वांटिंग टू पे टू विन ख्याल और फिक्र के पर में तू उड़ान बांध के चल सुकून के पैर में तू आसमा बांध के चल गजल की बज में शिरकत जो करनी है तुझे गजल की बज में शिरकत जो करनी है तुझे एक एक शेर में फना की जुबा बांध के चल ना जाने कब उसे तूफान का सामना हो जाए ना जाने कब उसे तूफान का सामना हो जाए पुरानी नाव में तू बाधुबा बांध के चल कमर सिवानी साहब की ये नज्म हमारे आज के फनकार की शान में है वो इसलिए क्योंकि उन्होंने फैशन जगत की दुनिया में अपना बहुत बड़ा नाम कमाया अपनी हुनर अपने हौसले अपनी हिम्मत के बदौलत वो उन्होंने चार चांद लगाए और आज भी उनका नाम फैशन की दुनिया में कायम है हमारी आज की खास मेहमान है Priya Trivedi the actor the model the VJ thank you for having me uh, welcome to our show jab main baat karta hu the real mannequin jo hamare show ka naam hai aaj ke episode ka naam hai aaj agar aap piche apna safar dekhte hain to how you feel about it wow um i think safar to bahut hi acha raha hai i have no complaints no regrets um shuru mein to kafi tough tha lekin if i have to now look back Um, I think I, um, I think I achieved what I went out there to achieve. So, model बनने की की तरह आपका पहला कदम कब और कैसे हुआ पिया? And were your parents okay about you getting into the field of modeling? So, I started my career very young, um, and I started with the Kingfisher swimsuit calendar. I did the calendar two years in a row, which was. And this you're talking about which year? Two thousand four, two thousand five. Um, that was my claim to fame because um, it was, it is still a very prestigious calendar to be a part of. But at that time, nobody had really done swimsuit calendars in India, and Mr. Malia had decided that he was a king of good times, and this is how he wanted to uh, project the Indian fashion industry, and. Um, there was yana with me there was katrina vidisha parvati a uh, very very senior um uh, actors now models then um so it it was very challenging uh, especially coming from a gujarati background um my mother was a bit skeptical she couldn't understand how i would wear a two piece and just pose in front of the camera but my father was very very um liberal so he was very encouraging so was my dada i have always been very comfortable with my body so um, i mean i used to also be a very fat child so i had trained a lot to get into the swimsuit calendar which was um, pretty challenging but um, i think it was the best time of my life so you talking about your family so if i ask you kis tarah ki bonding thi aapki apni family ke sath any memories that you want to share Definitely, my family has been very, very supportive. I have an elder sister called Binal, mm. who was already in the industry, so she kind of made life very easy for me. Um, she had already had to go through all the yes and nos with my parents, and you know, um, so it was very, very easy for me to say, you know, I want to do this because she was already in the industry, and my parents were like, okay, she's there, so you're fine. Um, but overall, I think from even though i come from a gujarati brahman family uh i think my family is very liberal they have uh, you know they they accepted us and uh, allowed us to do what we wanted to do and from the background i come from that's very not very common at all so it was good 
it was nice. So what were your struggles during that days? ऐसी कोई स्टोरीज आप हमें बताएं अब जब मैं देखूँ ये जो टाइम जो चल रहा है और आई कम्पेयर इट टू उस वक्त का जो टाइम था आई थिंक उस वक्त में ना यू नीडेड यू नीडेड टू बी द टॉप स्लॉट गर्ल यू नीडेड टू हैव आप में वो जो एक्स फैक्टर होना बहुत जरूरी था टूडे आई सी दैट्स नॉट हैपनिंग देर आर too many beautiful girls and everyone wants to get into modeling they use it as a stepping stone to get into bollywood okay. and they are not using it for what the industry is i like that time more um you know it pushed you to excel it pushed you to become a supermodel uh, aajkal wo supermodel ka bracket hai hi nahi sab models hai sab supermodels hai uh, and that's not that's not how it is uh you know in our time supermodels used to open and close shows you could wear just about any garment and make that garment sell that is what makes a supermodel you know it's like go it's like uh having an exhibition or being a designer and wearing your clothes that's one thing being able to sell your clothes is another, another thing. thing everyone's a hanger everyone's a model everyone it's you know you're thin you're pretty you can be a model but that's not it you have to work really hard and you have to step up the game or were, were they helpful and supportive yes they were helpful and supportive because i had a sister in the industry uh but it is not always the case uh yeah. it is a very cutthroat industry um everyone's there to uh to make their name uh it is not easy it is certainly not easy but it is much better than bollywood i can say that <laughs> So Priya uh, talking about the opportunities during that time what sort of opportunities opening as a model aapko hum us us samay mila karti thi you know us waqt na models used to be on magazine covers models used to be on hoardings on billboards um in advertisements uh that is a model's job it is not an actor's job it is a model's job an actor's job is to be in movies um maybe to you know of course take endorsements but uh, us waqt it was really fashion was reigning you know it was really in power fashion ke jo opportunities humko us waqt mil rahe the it was really it was it was appropriate you know aajkal hoardings mein bhi actors dikhte hain magazine covers mein bhi actors dikhte hain um ब्रांड एंडोर्समेंट्स में तो ओनली एक्टर्स दिखते हैं उस वक्त मॉडल्स सब करते थे दिस वॉज अ मॉडल्स जॉब टू बी ऑन कवर्स एंड मैगज़ीन या एंड टू बी ऑन शूट्स टू यू नो डू बी द फेस ऑफ अ ब्रांड अगर आप कहीं पे भी देखो आउट ऑफ इंडिया दिस इज द जॉब ऑफ अ मॉडल दिस इज वॉट शी डज बिकॉज शी इज अ पर्सन हु कैरीज ब्रांड्स हु कैरीज क्लोथ वी आर नॉट एक्टर्स वी कैन नॉट डू दैट Yes some 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 models do go ahead to become actors and they use modeling as a stepping stone but if i have to speak for myself i'm a model so so we had the opportunities to do all that and that was really amazing you know nowadays i don't see that it's very limited aap runway karoge um aur seedha bollywood mein chalo chale jaoge aur wahan pe aapko endorsements milega you know you'll get ads us waqt aise nahi tha So Priya we also have heard very you know uh, stories of uh, 90s and 2000 era of the casting couch you know that also very well existed in the modeling world aisa koi bad experience aapke sath hua hai or any stories that you want to share on the camera I mean there are a lot of stories you know the fashion industry is um is a riot <laughs> if you sit with everybody but uh, I have to say I was very lucky I had the protection of my sister uh my sister was uh, at that time um uh, in the bracket of Diana Suarez Carol Gracious they were all my sisters they mentored me uh they really held my hand so um luckily i didn't have an episode of casting couches but um i did hear of few stories but it wasn't as as bad as body male models ko kafi zyada problem oh, hote hain modeling industry mein Fem- females don't have so much of a problem there and you've also seen the fashion world very closely apne evolved hote hue dekha hai so if i talk about now kya changes aapko nazar aate hain ab fashion world mein oh my god pura world hi change ho gaya hai ya fashion okay. industry it is not at all the way it used to be aajkal models ko 
पानी और खाने के लिए फाइट करना पड़ता है दे डोंट गेट द रिक्वायर्ड स्टे यू नो वेन दे आर ट्रैवलिंग फॉर वर्क दीज थिंग्स वर नॉट देर एट दैट टाइम ऑल्सो दैट टाइम वॉज अ एरा ऑफ सुपर मॉडल्स यू नो वी ऑल केम विद अ सर्टन अमाउंट ऑफ स्ट्रेंथ एंड बैंड विथ सो um these days that's not there you know uh, they are not getting paid properly they are not being respected the way we used to be respected um so it's it's changed a lot it's not the way it used to be. and you know we've always heard, we've heard this phrase is that less is more and today is the world of pageants yes hum sunte hain har jagah pageants ho rahe hain every second third one we hearing we hear a pageant is happening earlier if you if we if we talk about you know let's say 20 years back two to three legitimate pageants models look used to look up to it now we even have we even hear stories of models you know wanting to pay to win a pageant so what do you have what do you have to talk about the current scenarios of pageants itni sari khoobsurat ladkiyan hai india mein and now they've all got a chance unko ek platform mila hai so i i don't i don't see why not india is is a very beautiful country and we have very very beautiful women and the fact that uh, brown skin is now internationally being acknowledged you know ye zamana badal gaya hai ab fair skin ka wo craze chala gaya hai uh, it's really evolving so the indian girls have a chance but i have heard of pageants uh, and and girls wanting to pay to win but that doesn't make sense no i ab आप आज पे कर लोगे लेकिन कल जब आप हायर प्लेटफॉर्म पे जाओगे देन वॉट यू गो डू यू गो रेप्रेजेंट योर कंट्री तो आप वहां जाके यू विल लूज पैजेंट्स जिनका पहले से बात हो चुकी है वेल आई डोंट नो आई हेयर रूमर्स टू ओके बट आई थिंक इफ यू हैव समथिंग आप में कुछ है यू डेफिनेटली बी पिक्ट अप समल नोटिस यू you know so keep doing the hard work don't don't get discouraged and keep pushing your boundaries you will if it's your if it's your time it's your time we are jo young girls ye show dekh rahi hain aur jinke khwab hain you know they want to get into modeling they want to win a pageant so what is your biggest piece of advice to them i think believe in yourself really it takes you a very long way um and why i say this also is because my whole school life uh, i was told I can't be a model, and because I was told that, I said, "No, no, I'll do it. I'll do it. Why can't I do it?" So I think really believe in yourself because that can change the whole game. Today's world is very, very tough. There are too many girls to replace you. Also, you feel the cosmetics and the techniques that we have right now. This has also given a lot of confidence. Yes, absolutely. 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 Yes, Yes, जैसे आपको वैसे करेक्ट बट आई एम नॉट अ बिग फैन ऑफ द कॉस्मेटिक वर्ल्ड आई रियली थिंक नेचुरल ब्यूटी इज अमेजिंग सो फ्रॉम माई पर्सनल पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू जस्ट स्टे नेचुरल टेक केयर ऑफ योर स्किन हाइड्रेट योर बॉडी नाउ इज मॉडल्स वेरी डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ फूड स्टाइल्स द ग्रीन टीज एव कम आप आपके टाइम में भी वही This much cautious कि अब हमने खाना पीना नहीं है You know, oof, I don't even know whether I should, uh, I mean, be telling this to the young girls out there, but I will because it it's really very massively impacted my life. Um, I was a very fat child, um, and I I had to lose a lot of weight to get into the industry, and because I was always on the heavier side, um, it wasn't enough for me to just work out. I had to go on a diet and there were many years I spent not eating. I used to have leaves and coffee and I was and protein shakes and I would survive on that. I am not recommending this to anybody because let me tell you 15 years later I am really paying for it now. Yeah. So it is not it right at that time when you're young uh aapko lagta hai it's okay no problem I kar lungi. uh later on the effects of it is quite bad so what i would recommend instead is eat small meals like you hear every dietitian bolti rehti hai aajkal eat small meals don't have so many carbs work out these are this is the right way of going about it so priya ye bhi kaha jata hai na modeling glamour ye jo field hai yahan pe you know people consider it is not a very good field 
देन एंड नाउ आज भी सो इफ आई वॉन्ट टू आस्क यू सिंस यू वन ऑफ द फ्लैग बेर ऑफ द मॉडलिंग वर्ल्ड क्या सही में यह गलत फील्ड है आई मीन वैसे आप सोचो तो कॉपरेट इंडस्ट्री में भी सेम होता है मेडिकल इंडस्ट्री में भी सेम होता है तो ये क्यों गलत है और वो क्यों सही है आई डोंट अंडरस्टैंड सो व्हाई इज फैशन एंड बॉलीवुड ऑल बी टारगेटेड पता नहीं आई थिंक इट्स द ग्लैमर एलिमेंट इन्वॉल्व जो ग्लैमर का जो एलिमेंट है लाइफ ज्यादा ज्यादा सबके फेस पे है तो आई थिंक दैट्स द रीजन लेकिन आई मीन कास्टिंग काउच बिहाइंड द सीन्स ये सब सब इंडस्ट्री में होता है कॉर्पोरेट इंडस्ट्री में होता है मेडिकल इंडस्ट्री में होता है आप जहां जाओ होता है and it is also as safe as other industry it's as safe as you keep it keep it okay jaise aap apna bartav karoge aap how you carry yourself what you invite it's it's up to you it's the same thing and limelight ki baat kare na itna showbiz aapne dekha hai you know glamour success and what i know from of you is now you found your peace with nature to so, apni life ki second innings ke bare mein bataye ye ye jo peace aapko inner peace with nature ye connection kaise bana i was making money what i think my friends would be making now in their 30s so um so i think because i had that that peak very early um i think that the nature has always been my solace uh i have always enjoyed um uh you know spending time in the forest um i love the water i am a diver myself so um i i i don't know i think it's just it was just a natural progression um itna sara travel karne ke baad itna life dekhne ke baad you know this you know glamour style fashion इतने सारे लोग मिलने के बाद आई थिंक आई आई नीडेड समथिंग लिटिल बिट सॉफ्ट एंड आल्सो यू हैव बीन वेरी वोकल बी अबाउट एनिमल प्रोटेक्शन एंड देयर वेलफेयर यू हैव आल्सो वर्क्ड वेरी क्लोजली ऑन दैट फ्रंट सो इफ आई आस्क यू हाउ डू यू सी थिंग्स शेपिंग अप इन टर्म्स ऑफ एनिमल वेलफेयर इन आवर कंट्री वेल देयर इज अ लॉन्ग वे टू गो बट थिंग्स आर चेंजिंग एंड दैट्स रियली नाइस um आई रिमेंबर विद um um विद uh miss menaka gandhi and um her team of lawyers very long time I'm talking about like some 15 years back we started the fight for the horse carriages at marine drive okay uh, at nariman point and this battle has been going on for a long time and it was only 2 years back that they sanctioned it and now the horses are banned from the carriages and the government has actually provided for provided the pe- workers with electronic carriages so it's been a 15 year struggle and uh, that struggle is very much on but uh, i i it takes time but i can see changes happening i have my own animal shelter wow. it's called kalote animal trust okay it has 600 plus animals uh we are completely cage free there would have been times in the life you know when you faced rejection sadness and all miseries has hit you so us time par aapka kya soch tha aur what made you get out of it was the inspiration that you got that time you know us waqt na there was no time to think uh life you was faced rejections uh yes of course i did not too many but yes i did uh but it there was no time to think life was moving at a very fast pace sab sab bahut fast move kar raha tha so there was no time but after i i decided to put my shoes up jab maine decide kiya i'm going to retire from this uh runway career of mine uh is when actually it all hit me sab okay. ek saath you know i had to deal with it and it was a lot but i i threw myself into spirituality and um so i love to meditate um you know i've been through art of living i'm going to go for the past now very soon uh and i think these um things in life um every day practices really help you stay stable in your head you work for the biggest of the designers in the country you know also featured on the biggest of the magazines commercial tv commercials music videos if i ask you it means success kabhi dimag mein chadi ye haavi hui 
यू नो एक्चुअली एक बार ऐसा हुआ था मेरे साथ वन आई डेड अ मूवी एंड दैट मूवी टुक वेरी लॉन्ग टू शूट इट टुक अबाउट टू ईयर्स एंड इन दैट टू ईयर्स इन टेर आई वॉज टोल्ड आई हैड टू बिहेव अ सर्टन वे आई हैड टू हैंग आउट विद सर्टन पीपल आई नीट टू हैव अ स्पॉट बॉय विद मी एट ऑल टाइम्स अ ड्राइवर विद मी एट ऑल टाइम्स फैशन इंडस्ट्री में ये सब होता नहीं है आप अपना काम करते हो बॉलीवुड बहुत ही अलग दुनिया है तो यू नो आई वॉज टोल्ड बाई माई डायरेक्टर्स एंड प्रोड्यूसर्स दैट आपको यू नो आप यहाँ नहीं जा सकते हो आपको यू नो एक आदमी आपके साथ रहना ही है आप ये क्राउड में मिक्स करो वो क्राउड में मिक्स मत करो तो उस दौरान इन दो टू ईयर्स यस आई इट डिड रीच माई हेड आई बिकेम अ वेरी डिफरेंट पर्सन बट फॉर्चुनेटली और अनफॉर्चुनेटली द मूवी डेंट डू वेरी वेल एंड वो हाई पीक से जो मैं घिरी हूँ इट वॉज आई थिंक आई थिंक आई वॉज लकी क्योंकि इफ देर वॉज टू मच सक्सेस इन दैट मूवी इट वुड हैडी गॉन इन टू माई हेड and if i ask about fashion as a craft as a art and design if i if i want to ask with the advent of time isme iski approach mein kitne changes aaye hain what do you have to say i mean uh, yes is definitely growing leaps and bounds there are so many of our designers that are doing so well in the international market uh, and we you know feel very proud that we are taking our country in so many places uh, apart from uh, you know Uh, Manish Arora there are so many other designers who are doing so well in Paris which is the hub of fashion you know uh it's good it's good it's good also that when there are so many fashion weeks happening um kafi um, new brands ko a platform mil raha hai to showcase and Correct. you never know what comes out of there And if I talk about the current lot of fashion designers, which are the ones that you think are doing well, and in times to come they will make a very big name in the uh, foreign fraternity, in the global platform as well. And you're very in, someone whom you'll really admire and like the work. I think Nachiket is doing a really good job. You know, you're very um, very low key designer, Correct. but really doing really really good stuff. uh i i have always loved shahab durazi he's he's just he's just brilliant so okay i'm not going to ask you about the 100 names i want three names out from three you three names uh, who are your all time favorite designers and you like you've always loved working for them wearing their ensembles okay so it definitely has to be manish arora he's wacky crazy really out there always been so challenging to wear his garments and even walk the runway it's always a head turner i like garments that correct that you walk in and you know people say oh my god did she really wear that i like stuff like that so it definitely has to be manisha rora one uh i have always loved namrata joshi pura for her sexiness the chicness she really brings the feminine woman out you know i i like that about her and um in indian it's a fight between uh, oh my god i just three names have come up Uh, definitely Anamika Khanna. Definitely. These are your top yeah, three. Yeah, these are my top three. I, I really personal favorites. I really love them. And I remember, I want to quote one of the fashion show that I was a part of and you were a part of was in 2013, the finale that Manish Arora did in India Fashion oh, Week, which yes. had the highlight tri playing. Live yes. Oh my God! You know, the amazing. Inter- oh my God! That was a very tough show. Um, we were wearing seven inches heels. Uh, my sister and I talk about this all the time. It is something that the we whole were, platform was turned into a glass. It was acrylic. That's called acrylic runway, which is very slippery. It was a, I think it was at least fifty-five feet. That whole runway was a long runway to walk. If you remember, I remember that. It was acrylic. We were wearing seven inches heels, and there was a follow spot. So when there's a follow spot, it's just light on you, and you can't see anything. So we had, we were, we had to count our steps to the head of the runway because. you could have just fallen off you can't see in the front there's just light where you are so that is i mean two days and highlight tri- tri- playing live one of my favorites too so you know live their next i mean it was, it was amazing. it was a very 
very challenging show. It was not at all easy. I really wish you know, you know all I'm, the biggest of the designers they you know recreate these. Things. I know you were there, so you you remember feeling that energy in the air. You know that runway that they invested so much money in. The garments were one piece to a model. It was it was uh, it was out of this planet that show. You know. Yeah, the the fifteen year old girl who started her career in the modeling world and then now when you found your peace with nature and environment with animals if I ask you this entire journey from then and now what has been your rhythm of life? Wow, it's a good one. Uh, I think you know I keep going back to this stay real and stay you. Really, um, the modeling industry has taught me a lot. And when you leave the industry, you know, it teaches you even more. Because life outside is not on that high peak. It is a normal life. So I and think, I think it's good to be a normal life. It's amazing. Life, yeah. It's amazing. I mean, the things I'm doing right now, I get to ride my horses. I get to dive in the oceans. I, you know, I mean, I'm doing things that I never had a chance to do when I was younger. Which I should have done when I was younger. So I just feel like, you know... Uh, find you and really really don't let that go um, there is a time for everything in life so uh, invest in yourself and um, and work hard thank you very much for giving your thank precious you. time we had a great time thank and you thank you for making us really those days of the modeling world. it was really good thank you for taking me down memory lane it was really good a pleasure thank you तो ये थी सुपर मॉडल पिया त्रिवेदी जिनको आपने अक्सर क्लिटसी और ग्लैमरस अवतार में देखा लेकिन असल जिंदगी में वो कैसी हैं एक सिंपल तरीका उन्होंने अपने जीवन का हम सबको बताया और ये भी गुहार लगाई कि हर इंसान को नेचर और एनवायरनमेंट के बहुत करीब होना चाहिए पिया की ही बात से हमें हमारे पी के बाबा की भी एक बात याद आ गई वो ये कहते हैं कि अगर इंसान दूसरों का सच ढूंढने में लग जाएगा तो वो सिर्फ और सिर्फ अपने जीवन का समय ज़ाया करेगा हालांकि उसे अपना समय अपनी सच्चाई और उस सच्चाई की बदौलत अपने जीवन को आगे ले जाने में लगाना चाहिए और अगर वो ऐसा करता है तो उसे सच का सामना होता है और अपना जीवन खूबसूरत बनाने का मौका मिलता है फिलहाल इस एपिसोड में इतना ही मिलते हैं अगले एपिसोड में लेकर आएंगे एक नया फनकार तब तक आप हमारे इस चैनल को देखते रहिए और हमारे इस चैनल वाई को लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब करना मत भूलिएगा तो चलिए हरियाणा का इलेक्शन आने वाला है तो हमारी हरियाणा की छोरी है जो वो हरियाणवी भाषा में किस तरह जनता से अपनी गुहार लगाएगी उसका एक छोटा सा आज शु, आज शुरुआत कर ही देते हैं बिल्कुल मैं तो भैया ये बात करना चाहूँ कि मैं हरियाणा से हूँ और मैं भी सरकारी स्कूल लाइन में पढ़ी हूँ मैंने भी वो बिजली के कितने कट देखे हैं कि डेली डेली मैं भी गाँव गाँव में तय हूँ और मैं भी सरकारी स्कूल में पढ़ी हूँ कॉलेज में गई हूँ मैं भी बसा में धक्के खा कर गई हूँ मैंने भी जीरी पाड़ी है मैंने भी गेहूँ काटे हैं तो मैंने भी वही काम करे जो आप लोग आज भी देख रहे हैं